Welcome everybody to Clarington Kia, where it's your experience, your way, every day, online and in store. And today we're going to take a look at a 2019 Jeep Compass Limited 4x4. 37,000 kilometers on it, absolutely stunning condition. Look at this beautiful white paint on this beautiful dusk day. It's absolutely fantastic outside and we have a fantastic used car for you today. So the purpose of this video, we're going to take you on an exterior and interior tour of all the great features as well as the condition on this compass. So what is underneath the hood? A 2.5 liter four cylinder engine, nine speed automatic with idle engine start stop, a really great feature to turn off the engine at longer stoplights and in stop and go traffic to save you fuel because hey, anything we can do to save you money, we want to do that. So let's take a look at some of the great features on this jeep and look at the styling it's a beautiful compass so up front we have led headlights as well as led daytime running lights and those driving lights down below you can see the nice jeep seven uh spoke front grille that's a legendary jeep thing they've had that for so many years and the condition of this paint is just unbelievable it's in such fantastic shape as we come around the side, take a look at these beautiful limited Jeep wheels, 19 inch alloy wheels on it. Nice charcoal gunmetal gray. And then taking a step back, we'll give you a nice side profile shot here. You can see the Jeep is kind of like a compact SUV. It's not a full size, definitely a good five seater size, but we don't have seven seats. So obviously a little bit smaller, better on fuel, of course. Now, as we come around to the side, these nice LED taillights on the back, they look fantastic as night. Taking a step back just to give you a nice little look here. Now we do have um, on the key, so nice Jeep key here. We've got a power trunk, remote start as well. Forgot to tell you that, but we've already got it started. It's a little chilly out today. But we'll get it opened up in the back here so you can see how much cargo space we've got. You can see lots of room back here for all your cargo. Maybe you're going to Costco, headed out, loading up with whatever you might be loading up with nowadays. We've got a little sneak peek back here but we do have the beats audio system on board the limited cherokee as well which is obviously a fantastic brand if you're not sure what beats audio it is think of it like the bose stereo but this one is it's by dr dre and if you don't know who dr dre is then you don't know that's okay all you got to know is he's a fantastic music producer produces some absolutely quality uh sound system as well and that's what's on this compass here coming around to the passenger side you can see that's also in fantastic shape I'm really struggling to find any kind of ding, dent, scratch, stone chips, something to show you to prove this is a used car and not a brand new compass. Cause what, did I find something? Let's see, or is it just dirt? Oh, we found, look, oh, an imperfection. Just, I mean, that's nothing. <laughs> I'm trying to find something. There's nothing on this. This is a fantastic condition car. So let's take a look on the inside, right? Beautiful leather seating no rips tears stains or burns and then taking a whiff it smells fantastic in here as well we've got a center armrest here for your back passengers and then down here we've also got an 115 volt 150 watt outlet and a usb port as well so two different ways to keep the electronics charged up back here for the kids that are back there perhaps keeps them nice and quiet keeps the parents in front sane for those longer road trips right Looking at the front seats, they're in great condition as well. Like I said, no rips, tears, stains, or burns, non-smoker. We have the Jeep logo embossed into the seat there. And then we have a power driver's seat as well. Another little look at the Beats audio. And then we've got our automatic headlights at the front. And let's hop in here. So, now that we're in here, we've got our controls here for our onboard display, which I'll show you in a second. We have our Bluetooth controls, cruise controls on the other side, a heated leather wrapped steering wheel. Really nice to have the heated steering wheel as well. Um, and that works with the remote starter. So in cold climate, when you remote start the wheel and the heated, the heated seats will also turn on. Now looking at our center display, let's zoom in a touch. So we've got um, a digital display here with analog gauges on the side, kind of the normal traditional stuff, right? Uh, digital speedometer, the tire pressure monitor, fuel economy, 10.6 right now, just at idle, really good. Um, and then it goes through the trip computer, things like that. But one thing I wanted to show you 
is vehicle info. We can also go to the right and then now it shows you all of the different infos uh, or information for the uh, compass as well. But of course, the most popular one is probably just a speedometer, right? Now, let's zoom back out and let's go take a look at our Uconnect system. So Jeep's got a really, really nice onboard infotainment system that they call Uconnect. You can see right now we're on the navigation screen. We can go to radio. Um, Sirius satellite radio is on board. We can go to media, Bluetooth audio, USB input. Now this also does have Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. And that will essentially, when you plug in your phone, if it's an Apple or an Android, it changes this entire screen to mimic more like your cell phone. The big advantage of that is now you can use yourself or your voice commands to text message and also use all your digital music and um, other navigation systems such as like Waze or Apple Maps or whatever you like. Oh my gosh, I got the hiccups. Um, so that way you can keep your phone out of your hand and avoid any of those nasty uh, distracted driving tickets. Don't ask me about those, they're painful. Put it in reverse, a nice big rear view camera, of course. And then also in the Uconnect screen, we have our climate control settings. So driver and passenger independent temperatures. We've got our heated seats as well as, oops, we've got our heated seats as well as our heated steering wheel options in the display as well. When we hit apps, there's all the different systems that we can go through here, um, including the available Wi-Fi. It's by subscription, but it's actually not a bad little subscription to have, especially if you've got young ones in the back that are always trying to um, hotspot your phone. Not a bad way to do it. It's a pretty uh, inexpensive service, but you can use all the touchscreen controls or big bonus, which I really like, is most of the controls, almost all of them, are still available by using the buttons down here on the dash. Uh, so you don't have to go through the touchscreen. You can still use these controls here. Now looking down here, we have our terrain select control. You can see right now it's an auto. You can go snow, sand, or mud, depending on what you're going through. Uh, and that will change how the four wheel drive system operates. And then we have four wheel drive lock as well, if you needed to do that. But Jeep's uh, four wheel drive system, I mean, it's legendary. Everybody knows Jeep for four wheel drive. You can quite frankly just leave it in an automatic and it will be a very great system. But if you want that added confidence, go ahead and make a selection for your terrain. We've got the USB and auxiliary over here, another 12 volt charger, nice little gear shifter. And then down here we have our um, emergency brake, electronic emergency brake. And then this is the idle engine uh, shut off. So what that does is really, it's an easy system. You get to a stoplight, you're sitting there for more than a second or two, it'll shut off the engine to try to save some fuel. A neat little system, right? Give you a nice little pan around here as I pull out some more information for you to see, and that is the Carfax. So a 2019 Jeep Compass, one owner, no accidents. And that's what we want to see. Six service records, so we've actually got some good service history on the Jeep as well. But this is what you want when you look for a used car. Make sure you ask for the Carfax so that way you get this verified information from a third party to tell you that no accidents on the Jeep, right? 37,896 kilometers on this Jeep Compass Limited that is in, arguably, I don't say this often, flawless shape. I mean, really, it is in amazing shape. So if you would like to purchase this vehicle, if you're from out of town, www.clarentonkia.ca, you can purchase this car online on our website, start to finish, A to Z, and then have it delivered to your home. Even if you have a trade-in, even if you need financing, we can take care of all those arrangements for you online. Or if you want to visit us out here in Bowmanville at Clarington Kia, just hop on the 401, jump off at Bowmanville Ave, make a left, and you'll see us. I mean, it's really hard to miss us from the highway. Then you can experience the compass for yourself, take it out for a drive, and see our amazing sales team here that can walk you through your purchase front to back, start to finish, A to Z, however you like to say. Because it's your experience, your way, here at Clarington Kia. So thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video and what a great used car find at Clarington Kia.